welcome to Antti's Brick Build, and today we'll be going over the Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tide set 4191. This is the captain's cabin consisting of three mini figures, 93 pieces, and this retailed for 12 US dollars back in 2011, 2012. Pretty cool. We have Jack Sparrow and two other pirates in the set. Before we go on further on into this video, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to the notifications button on it if you have not already. Let's jump right on in and check out the mini figures. All right, so with the three mini figures in this set, we'll start off with my favorite, of course, Jack Sparrow. Looking really nice with that really cool custom hair piece right there that LEGO did do for the Jack Sparrow mini figure. Some good torso printing and some leg printing as well. Does include his compass right there, which actually is a really fun add-on for this set. I do have to say that the kind of shirt, uh, skin poking out of the shirt right there in the kind of upper middle of his torso is definitely a little bit off color from the skin tone, but LEGO has definitely improved over that in the last 13 years, so if they ever do Pirates of the Caribbean again, I would expect they'll be really good. Now we have the two kind of zombie pirates right here. I believe the one on the right is the Gunner Zombie pirate really cool he kind of has a kind of patch over his eye very muscly torso and then includes a pretty cool sword on his right hip and then we have like the yeoman zombie i think his name is really scary looking face some pretty cool kind of like tattoos or kind of like different added details on his torso he includes a cool old pistol and a sword on his other hand so all in all three pretty cool mini figures now let's check out the rest of the pirates or the captain's cabin of the pirate ship all right, so this is what the captain's cabin looks like. There's a bunch of cool little details. We'll start over here with this little globe. Actually really cool on this kind of cool little stand, making it looking very elegant while getting the job done and telling the captain where in the world he should go in the world. And you can kind of see all the consonants kind of on here. Does it look a little bit different because this was course Pirate of the Caribbean it takes place during pirate times. So this is definitely going to be a little bit different than what regular maps look like but which i think makes this look a lot cooler and it's definitely a really cool added thing for this set and then we have this kind of table over here where jack sparrow is it uses come kind of skeleton feet as the legs of the table which actually is pretty creepy and then we have on this kind of four by four circular black plate it's kind of like this sundial kind of tourney dish that Blackbeard was spinning around, so that's kind of pretty cool. And it has a golden goblet on there. And then probably the main attraction for this set for me is this cabinet, where you can see ships in a bottle. So that's pretty cool. You kind of have like the black pearl in each of these. So even though the black pearl is only in one leg, it only did one print. So it could be two different pirate ships, but I'm guessing that one is the black pearl and one could be another sh um, ship that black pier kind of swallowed up and plopped in there then there's some bones around there some other gold elements and a cool little pirate's skeleton head on there i like that they used the spy glasses as kind of like the sides of the table legs or like the shelf legs. that's pretty cool and it kind of has like a dark um, brown base to it and you can have the two pirates kind of like standing guard around so pretty cool little play features in this pretty neat set Thank you guys for joining me for this wonderful episode of Anthony's Brick Builds. We went over a really cool Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, but Captain's Cabin. Really cool. I do wish the Blackbeard was included in this set, but at the time he was included in, I think, two or one other set. So that was rarely available to other people at the time, but now he's far more rare and hard to come by. So that's probably my only qualm in this set, but other than that, it is pretty cool. So that's pretty much the end of this video, guys. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to the notifications button on. If you have not already, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.